you have a blog, you have tons of categories, you have tons of content on different subjects. Should you be putting your categories within your URL structure? Hey everyone, I'm Neil Patel, and today I'm gonna to explain if you should be putting categories within your blog URL. The short answer is, I don't know. And what I mean by this is, I don't know your blog and the size of it. If you have a small blog with under 100 pages, no you shouldn't. If you have a big blog and you're planning on getting thousands of posts, yes you should consider doing it. Because at that point, the chances are your blog posts on many different topics. So, by putting a category, it tells Google what this blog post is all about. For example, let's say your blog is called blog and your domain is called blog.com. And let's say you mainly blog about different types of fashion and hip type of stuff. So let's say you have a post on men's fashion. Your blog URL structure should be blog.com slash men's dash fashion slash name of the post. And if you notice, I put a dash in between men's and fashion. The reason I'm doing this is because men's fashion is two words, it's not one word. You don't want to put a double dash in between category words. For example, you don't want men's dash dash fashion. You can do men's dash fashion, but you don't want to have double dashes. Let's say the category name is longer. For example, one of my category names is conversion rate optimization. So my blog URL structure could be neilpatel.com slash conversion dash rate dash optimization slash the name of the post. By putting in blog categories, it reinforces to Google, hey, this blog post is about conversion rate optimization or men's fashion, so that way they know where to appropriately rank the post and what keywords and phrases and what topic the post should be ranked around. If you have a lot of posts and you're trying to get to a thousand plus page blog, put categories within your URL structure. If you have a small blog and you're not planning on getting to a thousand plus blog posts, you don't necessarily need categories within your URL structure. If you're also blogging on the same topic over and over again, such as only men's fashion, and there's not a lot of subsections of men's fashion, you don't have to put the categories within the URL either. So now you have your answer. Depending on your blog size, you'll know what to do.